Planes don't run on pixie dust. Yeah, that's a fuel tank. And that's what we're talking about today on Plain Simple. Hello guys, welcome back to Plain Simple. Yeah, you've seen them. We've all seen them. Comments and people that, uh, conspiracy theorists that say that airplanes fly on whatever magical potion and whatever debate they want to start and the, the flavor of the week it is or whatever. Planes don't fly on magic, don't fly on whatever. They fly on fuel. They need energy to push them along and overcome gravity and friction and heat and whatever. And that energy is coming from fuel. Uh, it's the designers and engineers go a, a long way at hiding all the mechanism of the airplane and making a make it a creature friendly uh, machine to fly in. So they do a good job at hiding all the stuff that makes it tick, all the stuff that makes it work. This is a view that most people don't get to see. This is a view of a fuel tank. This particular fuel tank is hidden out of plain sight and that's because it lives under the floor. Right now we're standing in the cabin inside a plane. This gantry here, that crane, is to be able to lift that fuel tank out from its hole. This is the floor of the airplane and below all that down there is the skin of the aircraft that would be the outside of the fuselage and between the floor and the skin of the aircraft there's a cavity there's a space dedicated for that fuel to go in there if you look at this this is a big 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 fuel tank a lot of fuel can fit in there and that will fit under the floor in this cavity normally you'd be sitting on top of all this and not know that this exists under the floor this big space here is dedicated for that fuel tank now there's all, also computers and things and cables and control cables and wires and whatever but there's also fuel now this airplane does it not only have this tank in the front of the airplane there's another tank very similar to this in the back side of the airplane on top of all the fuel that fits in the wings both wings are also fuel tanks so guys the, the, there's a lot of room in these airplanes for fuel because they take a lot of fuel those engines consume a lot of fuel and that's where the energy is coming from to push the airplanes along and overcome gravity and move that weight that fast through the air overcoming the friction uh, it's not magic okay you wanted to see where the fuel uh fits into well here it is there's a good view out of out of at the fuel to one of the many fuel tanks there it is that's a fuel tank and it lives in this particular case it lives under the floor there's a floor there's a door coming into the airplane there's your floor below the floor is the space where the fuel tank lives next I'll try to show you how I'll try to stick my head inside of uh, the wing of another airplane see if the fuel tanks are open so you can take a look in there too and see how much room there is inside of those wings for to fit a lot of fuel anyways just wanted to show you this tank because it's kind of a rare sight that most people don't get to see because it's normally hidden under the floor outside of you but there it is all right guys this is the other view that i wanted to show you this is we're looking underneath the left wing of this particular aircraft this is the wing tip over here and we're looking under the wing towards the fuselage and all these holes that you see here starting from almost the end of the wing all these holes are all access panels to the fuel tank 
So you can see the wing, here's the leading edge, flaps, trailing edge, and all this section here, the whole length of the wing, is all one big fuel tank. Every one of those holes inside, they're not individual compartments, that is all one big cavity with structure inside. Yeah, let me, let me get some, shine some light at this. See that? Fuel can flow from every one of those compartments. From one to the next, to the next, so on and so forth. So, as you can see, the whole entire inside of the wing is nothing but a big fuel tank. By the way, this black pipe over here. That is a fuel quantity meter. That is a capacitive uh, fuel sensor, fuel level sensor, or fuel quantity sensor. There's a few of those uh, all throughout the tank, where the wings. So, like I said before on the previous clip, oh, there's another uh, fuel sensor, that other black rod over there. Measuring, uh, reading uh, fuel quantity from top to bottom of the tank. So yeah, there's plenty of space inside these airplanes for for fuel. They don't run on pixie dust. They run on fuel. If these tanks go dry, plane stops being a plane, starts being a glider, and eventually a rock. There you go. There you go. We'll walk all the way to the end of the wing. Here's the end of the wing. And you can see from here all the way. That entire wing is a fuel tank. Plus individual tanks inside all throughout the belly of the aircraft. All right. Like always, I hope you find it interesting, I hope you find it cool, and uh, see you guys next time.